Alrighty, welcome back everyone. That chair has been there for what a couple days now. I do have one taco stack order So someone did pick up a t-shirt last night. Thank you to everyone who's been supportive of the channel picking up taco stack merch If you guys want to first link in description below I know I don't bother you guys too much with my merchandise plugs like a lot of other youtubers, but uh, Just going to throw it out there for a little merchandise plug here early on in the morning. So Thank you for that. I do still have a bunch of sizes available. Uh, I did end up getting rid of my snowblower. Someone else did, uh, they did want it, but this is really disgusting. I'm gonna try to cut off some of this fabric and throw it out. Cause I'm gonna head to the scrapyard and I know they're not gonna be happy if I drop off uh, a bunch of chairs with all this fabric on it. I don't know how much iron I have. I don't have that much at all. So I'm gonna have to bring aluminum Oh, these are the hats, I think. Yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna have to bring aluminum and most likely insulated copper. Uh, so yeah, let's get into it. It's gonna be a fun day. I got a lot of things planned. I gotta get dog food. I gotta, gotta go back inside and get some donations. Uh, I'm gonna stop off at the thrift store. And then we're gonna work on that chair, I think, as well as go to the scrapyard. So let's make it a fun day and let's see how it goes. Let's do it. Oh, well, uh, I'm gonna grab this whole bin of aluminum and this big bucket of insulated copper. These are all the wires that clip off of toasters um, or vacuum cleaners or anything like that. And then they throw these things through a huge shredder and it takes off all the rubber and they uh, they have the copper out of it. They recycle the copper. Uh, much nicer with the, uh, the nice lighting out here. Still, it's actually raining out, so it's not that nice, but it's much nicer than being in that garage just like that. We are back at the scrapyard for another day. Ah, look at all the bins over there. Bins and treasures. I found a nail keg one time in one of those bins or is right next to it. And I ended up uh, getting it for free. over here wow it's a lot of air conditioners over there on the left so I dropped off a bunch looks like it's not really much here flip-flop that's not supposed to be here uh, I see a couple tins scattered but nothing vintage in terms of tin wise washing machine up there a bunch of these hot water heaters some mufflers So we'll drop off this stuff. I already dropped off the non-ferrous metals, the aluminum, and the uh, insulated copper. But drop off the iron, get back on the big scale, and head out of here. All right, so that's done. Wow, this looks like Christmas trees lit up. Let's turn off that light. Check tire pressure. So this has come on. It came on yesterday when I was trash picking. Um, I filled up with air. That light didn't go off, so this van is doing some weird things because I put air in every tire except for the spare but I the spare seemed pretty fine from the uh just by like pressing on it so I don't know uh in terms of scrap what we got we got uh 180 pounds of light iron I dropped off 15 pounds of aluminum and 18 pounds of insulated wire so I got a whopping 20 bucks the only scrap that I really had were those chairs, which uh, chairs and like some sort of shelving that I picked up with all those trains, uh, those plastic like riding trains and the train track. That was $7.65 for all that. So we'll be onward. I think we'll stop off at the post office, then head up to the thrift store. Um, and we'll see what else we can get into. I did want to work on that chair today, so we might have to stop off at uh, Home Depot, get some glue. I don't know why everyone just parks over here, but that's what I'm doing. Why park in a parking spot when everyone else parks over here? I don't know. This might be for like the uh, contractors. Hey, it's my van. I don't know, but I'm here. Uh, we're going to get some wood glue and then they have this kaboom cleaning supply. Wait, try to grab that. Try to grab that. Uh, there we 
we go. I think that's gonna work. Pick out my wood glue. I'm looking for this cleaning thing. I know, cleaning supplies, probably not great for the environment, but I like to have a clean shower. That's one thing. Having a clean bathroom. Alrighty, uh, foam tastics. I like this one. It's four bucks. Do it by the uh, ounces, 19 ounces, 40 ounces. All right, that's done. Got my wood glue and my cleaning supplies, so we'll be on to the thrift store, drop off these donations. All right, got my receipt here. Uh, one thing that drives me through the roof is like, they gotta hate people who do that. Just drop off a chair or a couch, leave it out there soaking wet, right in front of that uh, donation bin. People are crazy, you know? It's like, why would you, I don't know. There's no, like, I don't know. Unless somebody said, hey, drop it off there. It just, it's, it's tough. All right, so I made it back. I did pick up the wood glue. I'm going to try to glue this down. Looks like there's a nail that was in it. But I'm going to just go the cheap route and just try to glue it on. Um, there was probably a nail right there or a screw that went upwards. That's my guess. Uh, but I'm going to just try to glue it down. I still don't know what I'm going to do with this white bench. Uh, it would definitely look a lot nicer and more modern if it was in black. But I think it would sell easier if it's in white. Now, I have a black bench that's kind of similar to this on my front porch and uh it looks really really nice the tree guy just went by uh, i actually dropped off that uh that snowblower at his buddy's house uh who works a lot on those small things but we're really, gonna put this thing together for those who've been asking about my deck here it is this is my deck i don't have a space i'll put it over there Put this piece here this is that actually see I, I haven't cleaned this up this is the crafting wood piece that made look distressed it looks really really good unfortunately it was like brand new wood so it has a look it just doesn't have the feel like you see it's just it's brand new wood there's no chunks missing or anything but it looks really nice so we're going to glue this guy together i have to chuck this Chuck both of these. That's a good thing. When you go to these auctions, actually, the last auction I was at, the last state auction, I bought a box of these brand new for two bucks. Can't beat the price. Even if they're used, like I used them once, I'll never use them again. This, yeah, everyone was asking about my deck. Right now, I'm having a lot of issues with my whole house. So it's kind of like, I don't know if I want to do deck things, if I might want to do house things uh, instead. So, never know what's going to happen down the line. I think this is, this is, I don't know, this is probably the right seat. Since I didn't bring my tripod up, I'll put you guys on this. There's a lot of different lights going on right now. So the lighting's probably not the best, I apologize. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to just, I'm going to just glue the bottom. Looks like it was once glued before. I hope this thing works. I don't even know if I'm putting enough glue on it. Crafting with taco is always an adventure. Me being a numb nuts, I am not wearing gloves. I'm using wood glue. Oh, jeez. That's why it didn't want to happen. I just know something else is I put glue on the side like I just glued the side there and there's no side piece so why'd I do that that's not smart preparation um what's next maybe it's something
This is a mess. This ain't working out, boss. Not working out. over here to my handy dandy wall uh buddy i don't have those ones that you just like clip you know those grips i guess any of these things can kind of work uh don't ask me how those even work i'm just look at them i think i just need some of these c clamps uh, let's go for like these two probably can use three we'll try use this one this one ain't gonna work somebody's probably cringing right now because I'm completely using the wrong vice grips or <laughs> C clamps but I can tell you right now it'll all be all right guys Who knows? Who knows? All right. Just like that. Just like that, we'll let her dry, see how she turns out in a couple days, but that looks pretty good. If that stays like that, that looks pretty good. Yep, maybe, do I need to tighten this? No, it's pretty tight over there. Probably should put out more to the right. What the heck? I think the next person who buys this, if they're interested in it, is going to do some sort of repairs on it anyway. Just kind of want to have it all there. It might even sell easier if I didn't have it there, um, if I had it just separate. But I think if somebody sees the whole piece in one shot, has a better chance of uh, better chance of selling or surviving in any way. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna it's gonna wrap it up here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A little bit more of a daily video today. Kind of want to switch it up uh, and see what happens from here on out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you enjoyed the treasure hunt, if you enjoyed the video, smack the like button. I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow with a trash picking video. And, well, until next time, have a great day. Keep living the dream. Peace.